stretches out. McDonough can't stick him on the high side. So Johnson, though, gets a little bit loose. Sideways. Bartholomew just squeezes in there. And that holds off everybody else who's just waiting for that big Johnson to come tripping up. Well, I wish I could have said that back in gym class way back when, and I'm probably going to get kicked off the air after that. But the 24 machine of Larry Hahn is up in front. The 87 of Rex Cox, the third, right behind. And Billy Bartholomew follows the trail. Johnson hangs on to the number 92 machine at fourth place right now. He's got Kevin Smith's number 61, and the 26 of your points leader, Jordan Hahn, right by that. Oh, Jordan trying to hunt job on, on Johnson. Ain't going to happen there. As they dive into turn three, contact Smith into the back bumper. Now, I can tell you right now, Jerry Johnson's got about 20 years of racing underneath him. And about 20 years on those tires, too. But that's beside the point. Oh, they get wild coming into two. Johnson slides all the way through. Not a happy camper. But it's going to be Jordan Hahn to fourth. Meanwhile, up in front, it's been Larry Hahn all the way. That time's 14-5, 14-5, 14-4. Johnson circles the wagons in the infield. Looks like he's, he's going to try to come back. And clips and misses and hits the wall. Oh, another Saturday night, and I ain't got nobody. I got some money because I just got paid. Y'all have fun tonight, folks. Jerry Johnson trying to go for one more run at Jordan Hahn. He's got a little bit left to do it with. There's the love. This up the back end. Jordan. Jordan says, Obs. Finds a little bit more concrete. Circles around again. Going to make another run at him. And finds our marker tire again. So our track truck, who frankly didn't want to get anywhere close to the guy. Uh-oh, Jordan Hahn says, do you have a problem? He's... <laughs> In the category of, I did a neener, neener, neener at the racetrack. Okay. So we go over and we're going to have a chat with Mr. Jerry Johnson. Jerry says, I'm fine. I'm done. Honest, guys. I'm done. Just, just, just want to go home now. Yeah. And swing and a miss. <laughs> Now, Daddy Larry says, I think we may want to put an end to this now. Johnson comes back, gets a little piece of jo And we find, you know what, Jerry? So a couple of officials there, including a few guys who have been empowered by the state of Indiana and their local county to have an official chat with Mr. Johnson, sir. And Jerry says, what I do? Well, sir, you got a little bit loose out there. Said, oh, well, the, the, the steering was gone, sir. Johnson is out. Mr. Johnson will be dealt with officially. Now, word of the wise here, if Larry Hahn were to leave the racetrack, he's not eligible to return. Just a reminder here at the Napa Speedrome, and, and that is Larry Hahn has opted to leave the racetrack while leading. So restart line is going to be Rex Cox up in front, followed by Billy Bart. Speedrome fans, are y'all having fun tonight? 
All right. <laughs> yep. Part of the fun. This is Saturday night, folks. We have been doing it here on the east side of Indianapolis since 1941. And I assure you, I've seen some of the old movies. I've talked to some of the old timers. Even the midget guys back in 1941 treated it like this. So things haven't changed a whole lot in all those years. Now we're going to try and see if we can't get it out of gear here. An issue with the 92 of Johnson. <laughs> 